can't say enough about our kids and the, and the work that they do, the, the level of commitment, the, the attention to detail, the buy-in, and uh, the outstanding effort today with a, an offense as explosive as Creed is, um, to limit them with the number of touches that they had and to get them off the field. And what we did today uh, defensively, other teams in, this, in, the, in the tournament haven't been able to do, and that stopped them. And uh, our guys just battled and did an outstanding job. And, and our, our offense was able to run enough plays, convert enough third downs, chew up the clock, and yeah. putting that together made for a great team win. Thank you. Questions? How were you able to, to grind it out and, and eat so much clock like that? Ask this guy. He's, you know, a lot of our <laughs> plays today Ben called. And, uh, you know, he, he got us into the right plays. And, See what he has to say. Um, when we go through the preparation that we did, um, I mean, it's just going out there and looking at what the defense has given us, and then uh, just checking in plays that we uh, practice. So it's just a matter of uh, execution at that point. Brad, was that about as good a drive as you had, that 11 minute drive in the third, fourth quarter? Is there 90 yards? I would say so. Yeah, about you know as, as good as you can get against this team. Uh, they're you know they're physical. They're, they're uh, it's a great program. And I, I, I talked to coach and just said how much respect we had for their program and what they do. And to be able to execute like we did and make some key plays at key times. Um, I think was that the drive that we ended on the pass for a touchdown. Right. Yeah. You know, and then to finish it off right there on on, uh, on fourth down. And, it just made plays. Brad, the first quarter of the, the fourth down pause, the timeout, did you do your decision there if that play call why you thought that might work? Well, we thought, we thought getting Ben and Quinn um, out on the perimeter would have had an opportunity to get two of our better players a chance and getting Ben out running. And, and it turns out that our, our uh, third option on play, Zach, was the guy that Ben threw to. And, uh, so sometimes, Sometimes it, it isn't exactly how you draw it up, but uh, but the kids again it just comes back to the kids. The kids made the plays and got it done. What did you see there, Ben, on that play? Um, I saw them covering Quinn like uh, I thought they would be, and I thought it would just be a jump ball to Quinn. But then uh, I saw Crowley in the back, or I just saw Zach Crowley in the back of the end zone, just like sitting there in the wide open. So I just did my best I could to just get it to him. Addison, when you guys are just slugging it out like that long drive, what do, what do you think that does to the defense? Uh, I think it really, like, for us, it really motivates us to see them down and keep us pushing, especially for linemen. We see them huffing and puffing, hands on their hips. We like that we use that as motivation to keep going, keep going stronger and stronger and harder. Uh, Coach, you're an assistant in 2009, and then you've been back here twice since then, and obviously a uh, runner-up. How great does it feel to finally have uh, won it all this time? Still, I don't know if it's really hit me yet, other than the cold from the water. Uh, <laughs> but, you know, Every time you go down, the kids are great. Uh, every group we've had has been outstanding, and this group just was able to make plays at, at really key times. It, it really did, and with two fourth down touchdowns and, and stopping them. So I know it, it's, it certainly is an essential accomplishment, but you know it's just it's it's great having guys like this that, that buy into what you what you want and just work as hard as they possibly can for for our coaching staff. <coughs> Blake, what's what's it like, Blake, to get the to get the second one in CG history? Um, this is something I've been looking forward to for a really long time, ever since I was a little kid, and uh, feels amazing um, knowing that we're the only second team to go 14 and 0. Uh, my brother last year, he was super happy for me because he missed out on last year, and uh, I know everyone. Uh, we represent the entire team, and everyone who's ever played before us, uh, their alumni, and I know it means a lot to our community and everyone that's involved with it. Danny, how tough is it to game plan for their speed on, uh, when you're on defense? Oh, it's, uh, it's pretty tough, but um, I think the coaches prepare us really well for what they do every week. And uh, I just feel like we're always in the right spots at the right time. So I think it was, uh, we executed well this, uh, today. 